Red Nose Day on Today is created with our sponsor, Walgreens. Get your red nose today only at Walgreens to help end child poverty. This week, we're marking the third year of Red Nose Day here in the U.S. It is a massive effort to keep kids and their families from facing hunger and to end child poverty. And one of the ways that you can help is by buying these red noses. They sell them at your local Walgreens. They cost a dollar. One dollar. If, you, if you've ever wondered where the money goes, check out this family story. Today is a good day for the Wishon family. Parents Eric and Mary make lunch with their kids, 10-year-old Brayden and 9-year-old Jordan, thanks to a pantry filled with food and a place they can call their own. The joy of having a home again. It's the little things that people take for granted, honestly. Having a house over your head, having a, a bed to sleep in, having food on the table. Seven years ago, Mary was working as a baker at a grocery store, and Eric was a construction worker when he suffered a back injury. He stopped working and was prescribed pain medication, but eventually became addicted. The family moved and found new jobs, but before long, they were both out of work again. Things were hard for us. We definitely were struggling to find employment. Their situation deteriorated. Both became involved with illegal drug use and eventually became homeless. We definitely made some decisions in our lives that we're not proud of, things that we wish we could take back. We ran into some hard times. We definitely hit our rock bottom. In 2016, the couple decided to take their family back to Ohio. Their kids stayed with Mary's parents while Eric and Mary moved into a local homeless shelter. We knew that we had to take care of ourselves first before we could help our children out. That was probably the hardest thing, was explaining to them why we were where we were. And it was to better ourselves so that they could come back home. Taking care of themselves meant finding the right people to help. For the Wishons, that person was Jack Green. When God gets a hold of you, you're gonna, you're gonna do things you never thought you would do. The retired minister founded Ohio's Friends of the Homeless Shelter, where Eric and Mary stayed. The active 86-year-old was also a driving force behind the Greater Dover New Philadelphia Food Pantry. They provided 2 million meals for almost 100,000 people last year, with help from Feeding America fueled by donations from Red Nose Day. We can make people that come into this food pantry feel very good when they were scared to death coming in and embarrassed. For Mary, the experience was humbling. I was an honor student. I had a full ride scholarship to college. To come back home and be living in a homeless shelter in my hometown where I felt like I was, I just, I just felt like this is not where I was supposed to be. Jack's shelter helped Eric and Mary find drug treatment and family counseling programs that they credit with helping them both get clean and stay clean. Once we started living right, once we started doing the things that we were supposed to be doing, it just seemed like things started falling back into place. Less than a year after checking into the shelter, the couple is employed again, and more importantly, back under one roof with the kids. Eric is so grateful for the help he received that he now volunteers at the food pantry, helping Jack help others who need a hand like he once did. I know that if it wasn't for the things that Jack does, I probably wouldn't have had anywhere to go. And now, thanks in part to the support of Red Nose Day, Jordan and Brayden are happy to be home with their parents and appreciate all the people who helped give their family a second chance. It was an amazing experience to have a nice home and our family back together and to just have all the food we need. I never like felt being in a very good home before and now I can feel it here. I'll say thank you for all you did to help us. It's important to give back because if you give back, this could happen to, to somebody you gave back to. Oh, oh my God. Oh my that gosh. is beautiful. Don't forget. You, uh -huh. yeah, How you, can they help? You can help these families like the Wishons who needed help putting food on the table during difficult times. All you have to do is pick up your red noses. They sell these guys at Walgreens and you see what uh, what happens as a result. Something so beautiful. silly is actually so serious. Yeah, really. And be sure to tune in to our Red Nose Day special this Thursday at 10, 9 central right here on NBC. We are back. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.